Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. Five worst plane crashes of all time. Number five, Turkish Airlines Flight 981. The Yemenoville disaster was one of the deadliest plane crashes in aviation history, leaving all 346 people on board dead. Flight 981 was a regularly scheduled flight from Atatürk Airport in Istanbul to Heathrow Airport in London, with an intermediate stop at Orly Airport in Paris. However, on the 3rd of March 1974, the McDolan Douglas DC-10 aircraft began its second leg from Paris to London, after flying from Istanbul to Paris. Carrying a lot more passengers than usual, 335 passengers in fact, with 11 crew members due to a British European Airways employees strike. Close to 10 minutes after takeoff, the rear left cargo hatch suddenly blew off, causing rapid decompression, which, in turn, caused part of the cabin floor above the hatch to collapse and blow out along with six passengers who were basically ejected to their deaths. The collapsed floor severed the control cables, rendering the plane uncontrollable. As a result, the plane entered a steep dive, travelling at 490 miles per hour, or roughly 789 kilometers per hour, before slamming into the trees of Emenoville Forest. The plane immediately disintegrated into a million pieces, and of the 346 people on board, only 40 were identifiable. Number 4. Chaki Dari Mid-Air Collision on the 12th of November 1996, two aircraft were involved in the world's deadliest mid-air collision, which left a total of 349 passengers and crew members from both planes dead. The first plane was a Saudi Arabian Airlines Boeing 747 that carried a total of 312 people, including 289 passengers and 23 crew members. Whereas the second plane was a Kazakhstan Airlines Alishin LL-76 aircraft that carried a total of 37 passengers and crew members. The crash occurred over Chakidari in Haryan, India, and was due to a piloting error on behalf of the Kazakhstan Airlines aircraft, as the Kazakh pilots were flying at a lower altitude than the assigned clearance altitude. The odds of a mid-air collision are extremely low, however, unfortunately, on this occasion, the odds were against them. Later investigations attributed communication as one of the major problems in the incident, as the Kazakh pilots were found to lack English skills, and were heavily reliant on their radio operator for communications with air traffic control. As a result of the collision, new changes were introduced to air traffic procedures, including mandatory collision avoidance equipment. Number 3. Japan Airlines Flight 123 to date, Japan Airlines Flight 123 is considered to be the worst single aircraft disaster in aviation history. A staggering 520 people perished on that fateful evening on the 12th of August 1985, after the Boeing 747 crashed into Mount Takamagahira. All 15 crew members and 505 out of the 509 passengers died, with just 4 survivors. Around 12 minutes into the flight, from Tokyo's Haneda Airport to Osaka International Airport, the plane suffered an explosive decompression due to an incorrectly repaired aft pressure bulkhead, which destroyed all of the plane's hydraulic lines and most of its vertical stabiliser, therefore making the plane uncontrollable. The pilots were able to keep the plane flying for 32 minutes after the catastrophic mechanical failure, long enough for the passengers to write farewell messages to their loved ones, until the plane crashed into the mountains. A number of people managed to survive the initial crash, however, delayed rescue efforts led to all but four survivors succumbing to their injuries. Number 2. The Tenerife Disaster The Tenerife Disaster on the 27th of March 1977 was a fatal runway collision between two Boeing 747 planes on the island of Tenerife that resulted in the deaths of 583 people, making it the deadliest accident in aviation history. The first plane, a Pan Am Boeing 747, carried 396 people, and of the 396 people, there were 335 fatalities, and 61 survivors. However, the second plane, a KLM Boeing 747, got off far worse, with all 248 people on board killed. The primary cause of the collision was a combination of piloting error and dense fog. The captain of the KLM Boeing 747 plane initiated takeoff despite not being cleared by air traffic control. As a result, in conjunction with the thick, dense fog, the poor visibility meant that the pilots of the KLM aircraft were unable to see the other plane that was attempting to exit the runway ahead of them, and by the time they did, it was too late. Number 1. The 9-11 Attacks 
Although not caused by piloting error or mechanical failure, the infamous 9-11 attacks were a series of four coordinated terrorist attacks carried out by Al-Qaeda. Four planes were hijacked and two of the four planes, American Airlines Flight 11 and United Airlines Flight 175, crashed into the north and south towers of the World Trade Center. The third plane, American Airlines Flight 77, crashed into the Pentagon, the headquarters of the United States Defense. And the fourth plane, United Airlines Flight 93 crashed into a field near Shanksville, Pennsylvania, after passengers tried to subdue the hijackers. A staggering 2,996 people died as a result of the attacks, and over 6,000 were left injured. 265 people were killed alone in the four planes, and there were no survivors. The September 11, 2001 attacks were marked as the worst terrorist attack in world history, and is a date that no person will likely ever forget. <laughs>